Welcome to this edition of Street Smart. I'm Patrolman Craig Hoover with the East Brunswick Police Department's Project 18 Community Policing Unit. In this edition, we're providing a brief security survey for homeowners that they can perform at their own personal home or business. National statistics state that one burglary occurs every 14.6 seconds. Of all burglaries, 60.5% involve forcible entry and residential properties accounted for 73.9% of all burglary offenses. Remember, when we first start to look at our physical security of our residence, we want to look at appearance, how it looks from the street. Criminals operate with the idea of ability, opportunity, and desire. We want to eliminate as much opportunity for the thief. Obviously, we can't affect their ability to commit a crime, but we can certainly affect their desire as well. When we're looking at the appearance of your residence, Remember, we want to have our landscaping where we direct visitors by means of fences, walkways, and shrubs. It's recommended to plant thorny bushes around windows to make illegal entry more difficult and undesirable. Keep your shrubs trimmed and away from your windows so they don't provide a means of concealment for criminals. Cut back tree limbs and large branches that may allow thieves to climb into windows. The use of lighting and security surveys reduces the desire of the thieves. Be sure to use automatic timers all the time not just when you're away. Utilize specially lighting products in high security areas and then be sure to install them around doors, porches, windows, garages, and all other points of entry. Motion detectors in the rear of your property or along entryways or areas that normally remain dark provide illumination. With regard to lighting, create the illusion of your home by using your timers on lights, radios, and even your TV. Make your residence appear occupied even when no one is home to help deter criminals. Installing low voltage lighting is a cost effective way to discourage intruders as well as highlight a house. Remember the object of lighting is to increase visibility at your home and eliminate hiding places for thieves. Never leave clues that you are away on a trip. Have a trusted neighbor collect your mail and newspapers while you're away so delivered items do not accumulate. Keep some shades and blinds up and curtains open to maintain a normal everyday appearance in your residence. Never leave a message on your telephone answering machine telling people you're away from home. And arrange for your lawn to be mowed if you're going away for an extended time. Remember, large and ornate hedges may be beautiful, but they also provide a hiding place for burglars who need only a minute to break in through a window or door. If you use a spare or hideaway key, be sure not to advertise or let others know where the key is hidden. Avoid advertising your expensive purchases when putting out recycling or cardboard boxes that may have contained your expensive merchandise. When it comes to windows on your home, remember window locks or bars may be used to increase overall security, especially in all windows that are accessible from the ground. Use window coverings such as curtains or mini blinds to decrease visibility into your home. Alternatives to increase security may also involve the use of pinning a window so that your plastic security latches aren't easily defeated by criminals. When conducting your security survey, one of the next areas you want to focus on is your doors and lock security. The saying, you get what you pay for, really reigns true with regard to your lock security. Locks by Medco or Slage Primus are heavy duty locks that are bump proof. Remember the lock set is an important part in home security, but is only one component in the overall door security. The lock set also requires the installation of a strong reinforced strike plate and a solid core door to increase your overall security. These three components should be improved as a complete system in order to provide security improvements for your home or business. All exterior doors should be made of metal or solid wood and have strong door hinges on the inside of the door with hidden or non-removable pins. Be sure to install good quality deadbolt locks on all exterior doors and any doors from attached garages. These are quick to spot weak locks that may be easily forced open. Doors should have deadbolt locks with a one inch throw and a reinforced strike plate with three inch screws at a minimum. Door areas should also be well lighted and doors should have a wide angle viewer so that you can see who is outside without opening the door. Be sure to improperly install your door frames on all exterior doors and doors from attached garages so they cannot be spread apart. Install strong reliable deadbolt locks that extend at least one inch when in the lock position. Consider double cylinder deadbolts keyed inside and outside or deadbolts with reinforced strike plates. Install good quality deadbolt locks on all exterior doors. On the topic of garage door security, don't rely on your garage door opener for security. 
Thieves have numerous ways to defeat garage door openers, and once they're inside, they have all the tools at their disposal. It is imperative that the interior door lock be made of the same material that your exterior door to your residence is, and that your interior lock remains locked at all times, and you have a good quality deadbolt also on that door. One of the most popular methods for burglars to gain entry in a house is through the rear sliding glass door. Popular methods include prying of the door, breaking the glass, or lifting the door itself off its track. Well, you as the homeowner can do preventative measures that will inhibit a burglar or at least prevent his attempts to gain entry into your house. The use of charley bars or bars that are inserted across the glass and refrain from the door being pulled back can be installed. Pinning of the door or doors can also keep the door in its track and prevent it from being lifted to gain access. Homeowners can also purchase through a security firm polyester security film that's installed on top of your glass. Similar to a tint that you would have on a car window, it's installed on your glass. This film will reduce the potential that a burglar breaks through this glass by just throwing a stone or a rock. Remember, thieves and burglars want to get into your house quickly. This film provides a barrier and they takes much more effort now to break the glass and try to enter your home. If you have tools or large objects in the rear of your property, be sure to lock up your tools, provide a lock on your shed. If you have any large bricks, rocks, or any other objects that may be in the rear of the residence, make sure you secure them so that they're not used to defeat windows or sliding glass doors. If you'd like more information on how to secure your home or business, the Project 18 Community Policing Unit is available for advanced security surveys. Again, I'm Patrolman Craig Hoover of the East Brunswick Police Department's Project 18 Community Policing Unit. Remember to stay safe and be street smart.